Manhattan District Attorney, NY construction safety firm falsely certified workers, 25 people in a New York-based construction safety company were charged on February 28 for allegedly running a fraudulent safety training school, according to the office of Manhattan District Attorney Alvin Bragg, additionally connected to endangering the life of Ivan Frias, who died in 2022 after falling from the 15th floor of a building site in New York City, is the company Valor Security, and investigations. Between December 2019 and April 2023, Valor allegedly provided safety certificates and cards to almost 20,000 workers, making it the third largest safety certifier in New York City, according to a statement from the DAWs office. Valor Security and Investigations is accused of operating a fraudulent safety training school, misrepresenting the training that construction workers receive to be able to perform their jobs on construction sites, Bragg said. We also allege that the death of one recipient, Ivan Frias, may have been prevented if not for the defendant's reckless failure to train him. In 2022, the 36-year-old Frias is said to have fallen off scaffolding when a residential building's facade was being repaired. The Brooklyn business owners were previously indicted for producing and distributing phony OSHA and building department safety cards, and these charges are a follow-up to that indictment. The DAW claims that although Allure supposedly submitted certifications stating that Frias had finished 10 hours of safety training, which included 8 hours of safety protection, it had never given him any instruction. The DAW further states that Valor submitted paperwork to the Department of Buildings asserting that it trained hundreds of kids in safety while video footage showed empty classrooms. Additionally, the company submitted safety certificates for pupils using the initials LNU, which stands for last name unknown.